Three, two, one, go. What? Oh the my God. That's. I feel like there should be a better way to do this. In this video, we are testing the fastest way in the world to tie your skates. Oh, and Hayden is getting here. Hayden, grab your rollerblades. We're shooting the twist lace video. Okay. I'll wait for Hayden to get down here and then we'll start rolling. <laughs> Ready to start filming? Yeah, I just gotta get the blades on. All right, I'll, uh, I'll just wait over here. Every hockey player knows that tying your skates takes a little bit of time and there hasn't really been anything to speed it up until now. We're testing a product that allows you to tie your skates in seconds. So uh, Hayden, yeah. you want to toss me the, uh, the twist lace? I thought, you, I thought you had brought them. No, I thought you brought it down. No, you said we're gonna do the twist lace video. Yeah, you were you're up there and I said to <sighs> grab the- Just got the blades on, come on. You go get them. I'm not gonna get them, I just tied my roller blade. You've been <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors. Wait, is rock, paper, scissors, or rock, paper, scissors, shoot? Okay, we'll do rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh. <laughs> Best two or three? No. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I'm not gonna take my uh, roller blades off because I just tied them up, so. Taking the dirt road. <laughs> Good luck. Going up, I think, won't be too bad. Coming down. <laughs> all right. Oh yeah, and the twist laces are all the way up in the loft. Mm, great, I'll go up the stairs too. Oh, oh, it's uh, kind of like jogging. What about the hill? There's no, <laughs> no different than in the winter time. Right. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Jeez. Is that a little frightening? Yeah, I got some potholes I gotta fix in my grass. Holy jump, there's a full on washout from the rain there. It's almost like we need the skating trail from the winter in the summer. Yeah, we gotta find a way to put a trail there or something. Uh, but do we have the twist lace. Ah, so, nice. Dude, now we have to take our rollerblades off anyways to put the- Oh my god! <laughs> In the meantime, let's uh, take a look at the products that we got inside. Skate tightening wire, a curve. Let's get it open. Reminds me of like those old boot, like hiking boots. I think like uh, they use this in like ski boots and work boots or something as well. Okay, so here we go. It's interesting, looks 3D printed. Oh, it's kind of like rubbery. Yeah, oh yeah, it's got like a bit of bend to it. It's not very heavy. I think the biggest concern for me is like, is it heavy and is it uncomfortable? But yeah, like it's, I don't know, it's pretty negligible. I thought it'd be a lot heavier than that. Oh, we don't want to lose this. It's like a little tiny wire. Ho hopefully that's not important because that's something that I'd probably dump out by accident and never find again. All right, so let's get this installed. Obviously we were testing in rollerblades first. I'll test it on the ice. Uh, the concern on the ice is if you take a puck to it and like it explodes mid game, you're done. And it looks like it's got uh, fake laces. Or what if they're real and this is a hoax? Not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they're elastic. Yeah, they're just for show. It would be kind of cool just to not put them in. 
on the ice, I do it without the laces and just get reactions to the face off. Right. And then hopefully they're too busy looking at my skates and I can win the face off. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Strategy. Let's get these in. Alright. You still rolling? Yeah. Because I am too. <laughs> God. Now, I think the big advantage is how fast you can get them on and off. Like for rollerblades, if I want to go for a quick rip after work or something, just yeah. boom, throw these on, good to go. Also with kids, like if Mason has these on, if oh, I can yeah. put them on his foot, boom, boom, okay, let's go. That's probably me. Oh, that was kind of cool looking. I know. <laughs> it's like dude. satisfying. I smell my feet. They smell, <laughs> do they smell neat? Oh, we should put some chairs in here. Oh, Rather Stanley Cup one. just oh, yeah. chilling. Yeah, was, that's where they keep it in the off season. You didn't know? Uh, a lot of people don't know this. It's actually inflatable. That's why it's so flat. And why they can pick it up over their head so easily. Yeah, the, the whole thing with 35 pounds, just marketing. They try to make it sound cool, but uh, just pump it up with air, and it's a lot easier to store that way. All right, watch the instructional. Oh my gosh, I dumped the wire. I told oh you. I told you. We watched the instructional video. Uh, let's get these on. I don't think it'll apply to this. Oh, the ridge. God dang it. I don't think we can put it here because the Mars blade has this like lace bite thing. Oh no. And it's got a stick. Oh. I've got an old pair of Mars blades. I don't check them. Okay, uh, looks like pretty much every skate has something like this on the tongue. So we're just gonna go ahead with the installation and see if it works. And also because it's like 1 million degrees out here, going in the loft with the AC. Uh, so this uh, eventually has to stick onto there. If it sticks, I don't know, we'll find out. So we are going to take this little uh, fabric wire and we're gonna go from the inside out. We're gonna skip the next eyelet. We're gonna skip three and then go to that one and then all the way up to the top. Now we have this and it's gonna stick right there and this little notch right there is supposed to line up with that eyelet. So maybe we have enough uh, tongue here, like my hands. Press firmly all around for 30 seconds. And now we use the wire that I almost lost to feed the cable through the holster. So now that we have the wire through the holder, we're gonna put it through the top eyelets and then we're gonna feed it through the adjustment dial. Now I just tie a knot in each of these strings. And he says to, uh, to burn, to singe the end with a lighter. And then this should just sit right in there. Now you need to snap and twist the dial in place, but if you're weak like me, ask an adult. Oh, I think I did it. And let's see if it works. All right. I think that's it. One done. Okay, I can get my foot in there, yeah. Looks pretty loose. Oh, look at me tighten my skates in. Oh. <laughs> I don't think I installed it properly. <laughs> That's why I said I need an adult, okay? <laughs> like, you push push in and, and twist. Well, you, you work out, don't you? <laughs> That's what I was doing. Ah, there we go. Yeah. Got it to click. You're just so weak. That's true. <laughs> Hey, look, man, I got a hurt wrist, okay? <laughs> All right, the true test, uh, we didn't put, oh yeah, we probably should have showed the fake laces. They do come with laces to make them look good. We'll end the video with those in, just to show the aesthetics, because it's not really important, I just want to see how they work. We'll go for a rip, see how they work on rollerblades. Also, definitely want to test on ice. Might actually challenge the guys in the dressing room for like a, a competition, who can tie their skates the fastest, <laughs> see if I can hustle them, put like some money on the line. <laughs> Let's see how fast, actually first, how fast can I tie my skates? All right. Okay, so they're like this. All right. Three. Ready? Two. One. Go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh. It's not pushed in. <laughs> <laughs> That's user error. User error. error. User <laughs> error. Okay, start again. Start again. All right. Three. Two. One. Go. Okay, that's like uh, three seconds. Yeah. Okay. Oh, make sure the tongue's in. I definitely win. That was oh. like ten seconds. Dude, I just realized I could do oh. them both at once. Oh my gosh! Try it again. Hold on. <laughs> Jeremy, tie your skates. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, snap. Here we go. That was like three seconds. Yes. <laughs> Look at that. I mean, they work. Yeah. And it's nice, like I think once you start like kind of, you know, doing your thing, 
We'll still get going. Running man. Then, you know, you can give him a quick little, little tighten. Oh, like tighten as you yeah. go, right? Yeah. Well, because you kind of you kind of work the tension around. That's true. Right? Regular laces loosen too. That, yeah. And, and like if you have to tie it part game, like you don't have to worry about that. I always, so after the second period, always on the bench, right when I get off, I go and tighten one up yeah. and then tighten the other one really quick to get like that nice uh, snugness for the third period. Right. So, no, no need, just. Locked and loaded, baby. Okay, yeah. Feels normal? I can wheel. I'm fine out here. Yeah, this is good. Sick. Wipes out. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to be stopping and starting it. Oh, oh. <laughs> this is a roller blades, but yeah. yeah, that's good. I do think like you have to tighten them and then uh, skate a bit and then tighten them it's again. It's just because I think the bottom ones don't really just by twisting it they don't work their way through the eyelets yeah. as much you have to kind of m wiggle your feet around more pressure them. right when you put them on all the tension is at the top yeah then as you skate a bit it works the tension around you tighten it and then right look at this like will it eat through that eventually because it's so tight yeah it's hard to i guess if you really crank them yeah i'd say that's pretty successful yeah i mean it's definitely it's a, fast it's way faster for Mason skates, 100%. I gotta get a kid's set of these. Yes. Cause like for pond hockey, it's like you sit there and Especially tie. if like your hands are cold and, and the kids are whiny because it's cold. It's like, just twist them on and, and go. Negative 20 yeah. and you gotta tie like my skate, or first Olivia skates and Mason's skates. By the skates. time you finish tying the skates, the kids are already coming back off exactly. the ice. <laughs> and then my skates, it's just like, if I could just go twist, twist, you're on, twist, twist, you're on, twist, twist, I'm on, and then twist, twist, you're off. Twist lace, family package. Oh yeah. Yes. There should definitely be a family package on the Twist Lace website. All right. Yeah. Line it up. And now the test is how fast can I take the blades off? Let's say I want to head up and get a popsicle or a nice cold glass of water. Or a bio steel. Or a bio steel. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Pop. Pop. What? Oh the... my god. That's that's almost more satisfying than twisting it on. And I did them one at a time. I could have done a double double pop. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is a game changer. I say for recreational use. Definitely, yeah. Chef's kiss. But we will test for competitive use in the most competitive men's league, possibly in the world, at least in, in Aurelia. Yeah, the most competitive men's league. In, maybe the second- The OHL? Yeah, the Aurelia Hockey League. Maybe, maybe the second or third most competitive hockey league in Aurelia. If you want to check out the Twist Lace, go to their website. I got it in the description. Uh, they're not paying me to do this video. I just thought it was a pretty cool product. Wanted to test it out and help out a new hockey company. And uh, let us know if you want to see us test it during a game. And if you want to see some of our games, we got it on our channel. Hit that subscribe button. Do new hockey videos every single week. Bang. Bang, bang, bang. Bang, 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 bang. Look at the handles on this guy. Safe to say Hayden has worked off the dust. Hi